So imagine a story where a TV star meets a prince and they fall in love. Sounds like a fairy tale, right? Well, for Sophia Hellqvist and Prince Carl Philip of Sweden, this fairy tale became real life. Sophia wasn't born a princess. She used to model and was on TV, but her life changed when she met Prince Carl Philip. What's it like for someone who used to be on reality TV to become royalty? How does she fit into her new royal life? And how does their love story help change what people think about kings and queens today? Let's dive into the incredible journey of Sophia and Carl Philip. Before Sophia Helkvist became known worldwide as a princess, her life was pretty different. Sophia grew up in a small town in Sweden, not in a palace or a castle, but in a regular family just like anyone else's. She had a pretty normal childhood with her parents and her sister. They were a close-knit family, enjoying the simple things in life. As Sophia got older, she started to step into the spotlight, but not because she was royal. She was into modeling. Sophia had a look that magazines and advertisers liked, so she found herself in front of cameras modeling for different brands. But that's not all, she even ended up on a reality TV show. It was one of those shows where people live together in a house and everyone watches what happens. It was a big change from her quiet life before, but Sophia seemed to enjoy the adventure. This part of her life, being in the public eye, was just the beginning. It was during this time that she met Prince Carl Philip. Their meeting would change her path entirely. Imagine going from being on TV and modeling to suddenly being part of a royal family. It was a huge transition. Sophia had to learn all about royal duties, how to carry herself as a princess, and how to use her new position to help others. Her life before becoming royal was full of different experiences, but it was these experiences that helped shape her into the person she is today, ready to take on her role in the royal family. Sophia Helkvist and Prince Carl Philip's love story is like something out of a movie. They first crossed paths at a restaurant in 2010 in a chance meeting that would change their lives forever. Sophia, with her background in modeling and reality TV, and Carl Philip, a prince from one of Europe's oldest royal families, seemed like an unlikely match at first. But as they say, love knows no boundaries. As they began dating, their relationship quickly caught the attention of people in Sweden and around the world. Some people were surprised and intrigued by the prince's choice in partner, given Sophia's unconventional path to royalty. The media, especially, was all over their story, following their every move and often speculating about the future of their relationship. Despite the intense public and media scrutiny, Sophia and Carl Philip's bond only grew stronger. They shared common interests and values, which helped them connect on a deeper level. However, their journey wasn't without its challenges. They faced criticism and skepticism, not just from the public, but sometimes even from within royal circles. This period tested their relationship, but it also proved their commitment to each other. In 2014, after several years of dating and overcoming obstacles together, Prince Carl Philip and Sophia announced their engagement. This was a moment of celebration and marked a new chapter in their love story. Their engagement showed that they were not just a couple in love, but also a team ready to face whatever came their way together. Prince Carl Philip and Sophia Helkvist's royal wedding was a grand event that captured the hearts of many around the world. On June 13, 2015, the couple tied the knot in a beautiful ceremony held at Stockholm's Royal Palace Chapel. This momentous occasion marked the union of a prince and a former reality TV star and model, showcasing a modern fairy tale come to life. The wedding was significant for several reasons. For Sophia, it was the beginning of her new life as Princess Sophia of Sweden, Duchess of Värmland, officially integrating her into the Swedish royal family. For the public and the royal family, the wedding symbolized the modernization of royal traditions, demonstrating that love can bridge different backgrounds and societal expectations. The union was celebrated not just by those in attendance, but by people all over Sweden and around the globe, showing the warmth and openness of the country towards their new princess. The ceremony itself featured many key moments, including the exchange of vows and the presentation of Sophia with her wedding ring, designed by Prince Carl Philip himself. The event was filled with royal pageantry, 
including the attendance of numerous international royals and celebrities, reflecting the couple's popularity and the global interest in their story. Global media coverage of the event was extensive, with many praising the elegance of the ceremony and the couple's genuine affection for each other. The wedding festivities, which included a lavish reception, were broadcasted and followed by millions worldwide, making it one of the most talked-about royal events of the year. This widespread attention highlighted the couple's appeal and the public's fascination with their love story, blending traditional royal elements with a modern love story. After their fairy tale wedding, Prince Carl Philip and Princess Sophia of Sweden settled into a life that balances their royal duties with a strong focus on family and personal interests. The couple has welcomed three children, Prince Alexander, born in 2016, Prince Gabriel, born in 2017, and Prince Julian, born in 2021. These additions to the family have brought immense joy and fulfillment to their lives. Prince Carl Philip and Princess Sophia are not just about their royal engagements, they are also deeply committed to their personal passions and hobbies. Both are known for their love of the outdoors, sports, and commitment to various charitable causes. Princess Sophia, in particular, has been active in issues relating to children's rights and health, leveraging her platform to advocate for positive change. Balancing the public eye with a need for privacy can be challenging for any royal family, and Carl Philip and Sophia are no exception. They have managed this delicate balance by being selective about their public appearances and sharing glimpses of their family life in a controlled manner. This approach allows them to fulfill their royal duties while protecting their children's privacy and ensuring they have a normal upbringing as possible.